Okay, not having a horse is kind of shitty. I really need a horse. Interesting, so that quest giver that was in here earlier isn't in here anymore. Maybe if I go back in? Hello, I'm here for early morning bath. You're in a private area. You slip in there and take a bath. Oh, what's this? Our underhands. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I, I didn't mean to be, I, now, I'm sorry, just passing through. We really do need to go steal a horse or something. Stealing some people's beans. It's gotta be like an actual trail up to this guy's house, right? Eh, maybe not. Wild mushroom. <gasps> Wait, you can actually gather things in the woods? I didn't actually know that. I was messing around. Anything else? Oh, fuck yeah. Wild mushrooms in this bitch. What was that? Probably need that to make potions and stuff for later on. No way this guy's awake yet, right? Who the hell wakes up this early? So I don't think this is his house. Nah, well, maybe that is his house. Hello? I think that's his house. I'm gonna wash myself before I go in and steal all this shit. Chill, doggos, chill. How am I gonna get rid of. Fuck, shut up, dog! I could just fight the executioner. See, there's a lockpick thing right there, but I'm just gonna waltz in. Be like, hey man, how's it going? Oh god. What the heck? Oh, hi, sir. Hi. Hey, what are you doing here? Clear off quick or I'll throw you out. I, okay, okay, I'm sorry. Shit, lost something here? No, 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 not, no. Of course not. What's going on there? Oh, dude. There's, no, listen, man. There's, hey. there's somebody over there. Loud. You're a lout. What are you calling a lout? I'm gonna give him the old ruse. Watch this. Just wait. Just wait. Watch this. He has no idea. He has no idea it's coming. The old swapper ruski. I can't go in? Oh, you're being... Why? Yes, I can. And it's not even in here? Are you kidding me? I mean, I'm gonna take that. Oh! Uh. What's with you? 
Nothing, sir. Just look, uh, just looking for a hot meal. No, I'm not deaf. Of course not. Excuse me. Oh my God, I'm getting my ass beat. Oh, this is not good. Sir, I have no beef with you. I just need the ring. I'm getting my ass beat. Sir? Fuck you. I gotta go this way. Now you're done for. Yeah? What's Shut up! You smell like shit! Okay, okay, dude, I got no beef. I'm going in here. What's it what do you got in here? This is where you sleep? I'm gonna take a shit on your bed. I will I will take out my I will bludgeon you. I'm gonna bludgeon you. How do you like that? Yeah. Yeah. You should probably just run. I'm I'm here to murder. All right. Now I give up. There we go. Uh. <laughs> You're gonna sit there while I steal your shit. Oh, come on. Dude, come on. If I don't... Dude, it's gonna break. Yeah, I'm gonna get so upset. No! Yes! Whew, okay. Dead man's ring. Thank you. Where'd he go? Where did he... Where'd he go? Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Where did he go? Well, I didn't kill him, so I'm not a murderer. I just beat the shit out of him. I forced him. All right, well, that went well. I'm not gonna kill all those animals, you sicko. Why would I do that? He's got doggos and pigs and chickens. Come on, man, that's really messed up. I don't know where he went, but all right. Can you just find random things out in the woods that are not mushrooms, like treasure? I want treasure. Or just random loot boxes. So far I have not seen like a loot box that you can just open. Everything has been lock picks required. Ladies, ladies of the bathhouse. One of the pigs needs to pay for his sins. It's a pig, man. Pig didn't do anything. Ew, what is this? Just a compost? It's gotta be like a compost. Hey, I got your ring. Good day to you. I've got the ring. I'll have that ring for you. Good. Nice to know you're the sort of lad I can trust with a job like that. Now run with the ring to Wojtek, the miller in Kohelnitz. He'll have some work for you, and I'll have something for you soon, too. A clever fellow like you will never want for work. At the very least, I'll buy risky goods from you. I mean, the kind that used to belong to someone else and you can't sell to just anyone. Oh, Stolen goods. Oh, interesting. Thanks, but no thanks. I'm not a thief. Oh my god, look at my clothes. Um, definitely. Will you teach me to pickpocket? Would you teach me something about the, uh, milling craft? Like how to get things out of strangers' purses into your own? Aye. 
Why not? You're handy enough. No doubt you'll master it. Come behind the mill where we won't be seen. Going behind a mill with an old, old man that wants to pickpocket with me. Yeah, sure, old man. I've heard this before. I think I'm gonna fall for your nasty tricks, Teresa. Teresa, your your uncle's gonna touch me. Fine, fine, Teresa. You're obviously not in for the walk yet. I'll stand here. Pretend I don't know you're there. You try sneaking a weird up sentence. behind me without me seeing you and take something from my purse. First, <laughs> you have to rummage in the purse. The longer you do it, the better chance you have of finding something valuable, but also getting caught in the act. Once you've found something you want, you've got to pull it out carefully, but fast enough so I don't notice. Try stealing my dagger. It's there, mixed up with other things. Okay. Pickpocket. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. What? What even popped up? Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling. For uh, I obviously have no Try idea what the fuck I'm supposed to do there. Pick pocket. Oh, okay, picking pockets is no joking matter. If you're caught with your fingers in someone else's purse, either by the victim or by a witness, they'll raise the alarm, and you'll be pursued as a thief. In order to rob someone successfully, you first have to sneak up on them unnoticed, and then by holding E, begin pickpocketing. The first step is to grope around inside the purse by holding E. That's not easy, especially if your victim is on the move. The longer you can grope, the more time you will have then then have to select what you wait. The more time you will then have to select what you want. In or wait, in order to then steal, you have to exceed the minimum time for groping, which you will recognize by the background of the rose changing color from red to green. How long you grope and how much time you have left for stealing items is shown by the Okay. Pickpocketing. Here's how you Okay. Here you've dipped your hand into someone's purse. You have to get it out with the loop. Okay, I see. So you just un you just unclick it? What the fuck? I'm hang on. I'm trying again, sir. Uh, uh, what, uh, uh. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. Caught you. So how do I back out of it? this was for real, I'd be yelling for yeah, a yeah, guard. Yeah, 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 I'm working on it. Try it again. Where's green? No Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Why did it Try not swap it to green there? So I have to release it. Okay. Oh, but then it went to green. What the fuck is going on? I don't understand it. Now, how do I back out? Oh, oh I have to go all the way back to Caught the little you. door? If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Bro! Try it again. All right, all right, I get it now. I get it. Caught you. Uh, apparently, I don't get if this it. This was for real. I'll be yelling for a guard. Try it again. And I don't have that much time. Caught you. If this was for real, bro. I'll be this yelling is okay, but I am assuming Try the more you level up pickpocketing, the easier it is to pickpocket. Come on, give me green. Caught you. If this was for so real, so sometimes I'll be you just you won't even get Try access to them. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. I, I mean, this. I feel like this part is just RNG. Like, how the fuck am I supposed to? Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling. For I a realize guard. the longer you grope, the again. longer you get. You have access to the inventory, but the like, I literally, if I hold it and grope the whole time. Caught you. <laughs> if this I, was for I real, didn't even let go. Like sometimes it just complete it RNG. It says it needs to be green, does it not? Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. 
And you can't use the now you That's so bizarre. That's weird. That's, That's I still way. don't understand how it I works. I hardly noticed you were there. I think you're ready to try it out for real. Best practice on drunks and sleeping folk, so you don't end up in jail before you even get started. Thanks, Pashek. I think it's you're supposed welcome, to be really difficult at but first. But I'll be having that dagger back now. Because they don't want you to just be able to walk around pickpocketing everybody. So I, I honestly think it's it's supposed to be that derpy. Until you until you get your skill up, and then it'll you'll be able to do it. Cause here, I bet there's I bet there's a bunch of let's look skills like lock picking. Let's see what you can do. With, your la your lock picks will have will be more durable and last twice as long. After like there's just so many different skills for each one. Pickpocketing. Let's see, comrade. Increases your chance of pickpocketing someone with the same charisma level as you have. Such people are usually dressed similarly to you. When looting corpses, you'll find more money. Reduces your chance of being discovered when there's a lot of people around. The movement of the cursor in a pickpocketing uh, pick victim's inventory will be twice as fast. Reveal stats for half the items in a pickpocketing victim's purse. Immediately reveals one of the items in a pickpocketing victim's inventory. Like, so there's just a bunch of stuff you can get. Reveals all the items. No, I gave him back the dagger. Hmm. All right. Fair enough. What, what if are you I... doing? Nothing. Just pickpocketing your Doesn't uncle. <laughs> what if I did? I took the dagger back. Ooh, what if I pickpocketed her? I can't. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. All right. Let's see. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Missions, quest logs. Take the ring to the miller. I mean, I kind of want to just continue to do this one. How, where, how far is this? Oh, it's not that far. It's in this city. I'll be back. Now, what's the quickest way? Is it that way? Gotta go all the way to the castle. Oh no, that's super far away. Never mind. This is all the way over here. Oh, that's serratic. What the fuck? Oh, it's up here. I see it. Shoot, we need a horse before we do that. All right, let's do the main mission. Can I try? Oh, I see. So this is the. I think the fast travel has to be in this circle to be able to for you to use it. So, oh no, that worked. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know how fast travel works either. Wolfram hey. Pruda. Who are you, Wolfram? Good health to you. You got nothing to tell me? Uh-oh. Halt! Who are you and where are you going? I'm Henry, son of the Scarlet's blacksmith. I'm going to see my liege, Sir Radzig Kabila of Dvoyets. Of course you are, lad. And I'm the Pope. What do you want from his lordship, and what makes you think he'll see you? I have to tell Sir Radzig about what happened to his sword. I'm Sir Radzig's blacksmith. Let me in. Is it money you're after? I may not look the part, but I know about honor and duty. And mine is to tell Sir Radzig what happened to the sword he commissioned. All right, then. Go ahead. It'll be your that skin if Sir Radzig isn't pleased. What? What the hell are you doing? What? You just told me to go by. What's the problem? Discovered camp. Are you a beggar? <laughs> I could <laughs> I could pickpocket Cornelius. Hello, I'm here to see Radzig. Could that be the Smith's son, Hound? On my soul, it is him. What are you doing here, lad? We thought you were done for. I'm going to see Sir Radzig. I was attacked by bandits. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. I must speak with Sir Radzig. Is he here? He's in the palace with Sir Hanush of Rattai. They're feasting in the knight's hall. What do you want? They're with feasting? Him? My father made a him feast? a sword. He, um, he asked me to deliver it to Sir Radzig. I don't see any sword. No. Bandits attacked me and stole it. I need to tell his lordship what happened. And then I'm going to find the sword. Of course you are, Hal. Good luck. Thanks. Who calls a Henry? Ooh, Hal. Hal is not short for Henry. 
That's just weird. Hello, guard. Oh. What? It must be this room. No? Hello, guard. Oh, I can't talk to you. Oh, it must hey. be. It must be. Oops. Top? Somebody. Okay, there's a wall there, apparently. Be a bit more careful. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. After you. No, there can't be a wall here. Why can't I not walk Are you up this? serious? Okay. I don't know. <laughs> the shitter's just right there. You are in a private area. Hello. I don't understand. It's showing the marker right there, but the door's locked. Well, I'm not breaking into there. Oh, it's right here. Sir, can I get... Hello? Hmm. It's gotta be up above, but I can't get up there. It won't let me up the stairs. <laughs> what is it? What the hell? That's what I'm saying, man. What the hell? Oh. Oh, there we go. There's the trick. Ah. Your graces, I have to tell you in all seriousness that this land of ours is in the shit. Deep fucking shit. Don't you agree? I might not have put it as eloquently as you, Hanush. But I've been driven out of my own castle, so I'm hardly going to disagree. Indeed. But Pirkstein is yours for as long as you need it. There's room enough for your men and you here at Ratte, and I'm sure my ward won't have any objection to me lending you his castle. I'd be honored. Pirkstein is at your disposal as long as you wish, Your Grace. Just as well you have another castle at the other end of town, eh? <laughs> Uh, at any rate, I'm beholden to you, Sir Hans, and to you, Sir Hanush. Mm. I don't like to speak ill of your people, Sir Radzik, but, well, there's no love lost between the townsfolk and the refugees. There's been talk of criminality. No, they'll have to get used to it until the situation's resolved. But when will it be resolved? And what on God's earth is this war even about? I won't lie, sir. I don't understand it. I don't understand you your haircut. Alone, I believe Sigismund's original intention was to persuade Wenceslas to accept the imperial crown and to leave the rule of Bohemia to him. Well, who could blame him? I know Wenceslas is a friend of yours, Radzig, but even you have to admit he brought it upon himself. I can't deny the king neglected affairs of state for other pursuits. There is a need for order in the land, but I don't think the lords who sided with Sigismund realized just what Hungarian order looks like. <laughs> Hungarian order. <laughs> what concerns me, sir, is how a good Christian could resort to such brutality. To give him his due, I don't think he expected the lords of this country to stand behind the king. But thanks to him, we're tearing ourselves apart, and now he has to get things under control. But why in God's name does he have to use those barbarians? Money is the root of all evil, young sir. Wars are costly, and this one has dragged on for a year. Sigismund ran out of coin for knights, so he recruited those whore sons that settled in Hungary. The less he pays, the more they make up for it with plunder. That's why he attacked us. He was after our silver. Oh, shit. What are you doing? You have no business here. Clear off. Wait, it's Henry. Yeah. Henry, Fuck who off. disappeared after I clearly ordered him to remain at Taunberg. I'm sorry, sir, but I had to bury my parents. Had to? Do you think you were the only man who lost someone there? But the others listened to their lord. And it wasn't just your own life you nearly threw away. So Robard and his men risked theirs to save you. I'm sorry, but I had to. No, oh, there you go. When you have to, you have to, Radzik. <laughs> your father was a remarkable man. And your mother, well, she was remarkable too. Hey, hey, They watch deserve a Christian burial. Did you manage that at least? No. I was attacked by thieves. I wouldn't be here now if it wasn't for that girl. 
girl? The Miller's daughter, Teresa. <laughs> the Miller's daughter saved you from the footpads? Oh, there's a tale to tell your children. Uh, I owe her my life. She distracted them and then brought me to Ratai. But without a robot, we'd both be dead. Oh, that's what I call a good woman. Hang on to that one, lad. Still, it's a great shame your parents are buried in unconsecrated What the fuck is wrong ground. with this dude's hair? That means purgatory for them. Be quiet, friar. I didn't invite you here to eat me out of house and home and deliver a sermon while you were doing it. If you're so concerned, Father, maybe you should save the innocent souls of these fine Christians yourself. Go to Scalitz and consecrate their graves. I assure you, if you're killed by bandits, your soul will soar straight to heaven. As long as someone buries you in consecrated ground first. If there's anything left to bury, that plump carcass of yours would be quite a feast for the wolves and the crows. Damn. And one skeleton looks much like another, so how would we know which were your ordained bones or those of Sigismund's Tartars? Be that as it may, why have you come here? I must get your sword back. Sword? My sword hangs here at my side. No, the sword my father forged for you. One of those thieves stole it from me. They almost killed him and he already wants to go back. Takes after his father, I suppose. Lad. I've lost a castle, a village, silver mines, and a good half of my subjects. Why would I miss one sword? Because it's the last one my father forged, and I promised him I'd deliver it to you. I understand. I'd feel the same way. But prudence is the better part of valor, and a dead man keeps no promises. Aye. The woman had to save his fat from the fire, and now he wants revenge. What kind of fool are you, boy? He's no fool. Henry, you have courage. But you need training, arms, a horse. Or do you mean to beat this thief at dice? No, sir. Please, take me into your service and give me the chance to learn these things. The gall of him. Fled from the enemy, disobeyed your orders, duped Sir Divish, lost your sword, put Sir Robard in danger with his actions, and now he wants a promotion. Sir Capon's right. What you say is certainly true, except for fleeing the enemy. You would have run as well, believe me. Henry's earned some punishment, but how do you punish someone who's already lost everything, hmm? Courage and blind obedience are good qualities for a soldier, but a wise man also appreciates loyalty, perseverance, and determination. Besides, that was a fine sword that his father made. If he thinks he can get it back, I won't turn it down. My lord, he's a peasant. You can't make a squire of a peasant. Why not? Someone made a priest of a pig. Damn! He's not a peasant father, he's a blackbeard. Recent events have left me in need of his skills. So, you'd like to enter my service? So, I. Yes, I would. You won't regret it. <laughs> oh, I probably will. I'm doing this for your father, lad. Don't disappoint me. Oh, fortune has finally smiled on you today, lad. Make the most of it. Now that I think about it, Sir Hanush, the boy needs training and experience, and you need spear carriers. That's true. The bailiff is always complaining about your people making trouble in the camp. Maybe one of their own among the guard might help. It might. In any event, it will prove valuable experience. <laughs> but let's be clear. You're the one paying him. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Bernard, see to his training, and then send him to the bailiff. Yes, sir. And don't spare him. You can rely on it, sir. Don't forget, Henry. Don't disappoint me. I won't, my lord. Damn, what a scene. All right, go to... Pre oh, objective completed. Awakening. Achievement unlocked. Quest completed. All right. Well... Train hard, fight easy. Quest started. What the heck? Come on. Okay. Uh, let's see. Quest log. Uh, Sir Radzig wants me to undertake training with his captain, Sir Bernard. He has a reputation for being gruff, and I'm not sure whether he'll be too happy about Sir Radzig taking me, a blacksmith's son, into his service. Go to the training ground and talk to Captain Bernard. 
Captain Bernard? Sir, I've come to learn under your guidance. Yeah, I'm looking for Captain Bernard. God be with you. And another thing. Holy shit. Okay, thanks, thanks. for now. That's a lot. And another thing, a whole goddamn long list. Oh, just a couple of things. I've lost everything. My home. Sucks, man, me too. Hello, madame. Where's this goddamn training yard? Also. Holy shit! Activity giver? What is a star? Quest... Quest Tripster? Is that what it said? Tip, quest Tipster. This is a big city. Okay, I discovered a traitor. What is this? There's a bunch of stuff over here. God damn. Alright. Discovered a baker. This guy, what do you got for me? Good day. Are you the brawler who takes bets? What's it to you? Well, I'm a Scalitz refugee, and I'd like to try my luck against you. Hang on, I know who you are. And I'll only fight you for silver. Got it? What are the rules? Are there any rules? Aye, a couple. Whoever lands on his ass or runs, loses. And no knives, axes, or any of that shit. You'll forfeit your wager for that. Got it? Got it. I am not going to fight this guy right now. I do not think I am prepared to fight that man. But I will fight you another day, sir, when I have gotten more training. Choose me, chickens. What is this? Ooh, innkeeper. Jesus Christ be praised. Is that, does anyone near... Oh, okay. Do you know if there's anyone around here who could use my help? Could be. We're told our local gamekeeper was looking for help with something a while back. Why don't you ask him if he still needs help? Okay, thank you. Does anyone... Do you know if there's anyone around here who could use my help? He's going to say the same thing. Mm. No one I can take off. <laughs> okay, thank you. What is that little symbol? Quest giver. Oh, this is probably this, the guy they were just talking about. The huntsman. Hello, sir. Good day to you. Some people can teach you. For some, for some lessons, you will have to know something already, though. There may be more than one trainer for each skill, but there are always four lessons. Training. Hunting. I'd like you to show me some hunting tricks. Certainly. <laughs> He's so stoked. Beginner. Requires level 5, requires level 10, requires level 15, maybe another time. Beginner. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. How much? Holy shit. Uh, maybe another time. Maybe another time. Any work for me here by any chance? That depends. How's your hearing? What? I said, how's your hearing? It's perfectly fine. You don't have to scream at me. I mean, why are you asking? Because there is this one little job going. But I need someone who knows the area well and has good ears. I can handle that. I ought to be able to handle that. Fine. So here's the problem. My friend is a birder, and he left a few rare nightingales with me for safekeeping. They're good to trade. Rich gentlemen hang them caged up in their chambers. It keeps their wives from fretting when they're off drinking and wenching. I see. Jesus. The trouble is the nightingales are gone. I don't know how, but the birds have flown. Uh, wait, so you mean you need me to find them? Hang on, surely you're not asking me to go flapping around looking for birds? Not exactly. Luckily, their wings are clipped. 
so they won't be far, and the watchman in the tower told me they headed off toward Brannock. I have traps prepared. It should be easy enough to catch them in those. Fine, but how will I know where to put the traps? I hear they like pine woods, and there's a pine-covered hill just before Brannock. Right. A bloody great wood. That's just why you need to listen out. Nightingales have a distinctive song. When you hear it close by, you set a trap on the spot. They kept twittering away the whole time they were here, so I can remember the tunes. I'll sing them to you. I can't wait. It went something like this. <coughs> what? People keep birds like that in their houses. It's like the sound a cat makes when you pull it by the tail. You know how it is. The gentry's got all manner of odd tastes. The question is, can you remember it? Uh, can you repeat it? Can you repeat that? Of course. <laughs> remember it now? Can you repeat that? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> remember it now? What the? Yeah, no, I definitely remember it now. Yes, I'll remember. Definitely. Right, here are the traps. Don't forget, so once he's you hear dying. a nightingale, set a trap nearby. He ought to be caught in it after a while. I'll do that. Thank you. And then hopefully when I save up some more money, I can come back for some training.